All right, you guys remember multiplying expressions like this? So, FOIL, FOIL method, very good. So, let's look at the first, which is 6.4a times 0.5a, and the outers, so we'll add this to 6.4a times a negative 2. The inners, so we'll add this to negative 11.2 times 0.5a. And I'm going to need more space. And then I'll add this to negative 11.2. times the negative 2. Oh, that's... There we go. Last. Is that an expression okay? So here we go. We got 6.4a times 0.5a. That's going to be 3.2a squared plus 6.4a times negative 2. That's going to end up being a negative 12.8a and then we got a negative 11.2 times 0.5a so that will be a negative uh, 5.6a I think I did that right and here we've got two negatives which is going to give us positive anyways 11.2 times that 2 would give us a 20 2.4. Well, if there's any like terms, so don't stop here. If there are any like terms, we should combine them. So we have this 3.2a squared. There's no other a squared. So it's going to say stay a 3.2a squared. But I have these two a's right here. Negative 12.8a minus 5.6a. Uh, negative 18.4a. And then our constant doesn't have any other like terms either. This one has a degree of 2, and this one has a degree of 1. Since they're differing degrees, we can't combine those.